Hey, how's it going, America? Uh, my name is Kishal, and I'm uh, an evangelist here for at DigitalOcean. Now, normally this is the part in the demo where I'd ask you guys how many of you guys have heard of us. And I realize I can't do that right now, and I'm probably talking to myself right now. So I'm just going to go forward pretending like that didn't just happen. Uh, so I work for DigitalOcean. DigitalOcean is, the, is a really easy way to host your application. You can deploy and run a cloud-based a cloud server in 55 seconds, and I'm going to show you just how easy that is to do. You go to digitalocean.com, you hit login, you hit create a droplet, you decide which one of the many things you want to put on this droplet. Say I want, I want it in my droplet LHD for local hack day, I want it in New York, and let's get an application on there. Let's get a Rails app on there, and it's going to be de deployed with Nginx and Unicorn, and I'm going to add an SSHD and I'm going to create this droplet. And now 55 seconds later, uh, in the background, we're gonna spin up this server for you and we're gonna give you root access to it. So we're just gonna wait another 30 seconds for, for this to happen. And let me just add a bit of information to this by saying uh, you have full root access to this application. It's like a server that you physically own, but we maintain and we handle the uptime for. So we're gonna wait another few seconds just while, just while this happens. And I just got an email from DigitalOcean saying my droplet is up and running. So we're just gonna give it another sec to, for the HTTP request to go through, because I might not be online. Hmm. That was interesting. Why didn't that work? Uh, all right, so I'm gonna show you something a bit different. We're gonna log in. So instead of that, instead of using that, that droplet, which for some reason wouldn't update its status, there it is. Okay, so this droplet, we give you an IP address and you have root access to it out of the box. So first of all, we're just gonna to go to that IP address and see what happens. And you'll see right away that we're, we have your DigitalOcean Rails application. It's just Rails new, and we, we just call it Rails New, and it's a brand new application. You can change whatever you want on this. And on top of that, you have root access to it. So if you were to SSH into root at this IP address, uh, this is root access. You can sudo su. You can log out. I meant exit. Exit again. And so we're going to log in again, and let's just go ahead and Find this, find this file right here, and let's write some. Let's write you guys a, good, a nice note. Vim? Do I have Vim? We're gonna install Vim really quick. I'll just take a sec. Okay, and now we're gonna Vim this file, and so this is the physical, uh, the physical web page. So instead of DigitalOcean Rails application, we're gonna say. Welcome to local hack day. I'm going to save. We're going to do some refreshes. And there we have it. Welcome to local hack day. This is your brand new up and running Rails application. You can git clone the project that you've been working on all, all day today, and it'll be up and running in a matter of minutes. So hope you guys use this relation today. If you need any help, please hit me up at Sorry. Uh, this is my email. It should be on your screens right now. Take a sec to write it down. I'm kparik at do.co and I'm twitter.com slash cashbagel. If you need any help, please uh, feel free to reach out. I'll be here all day. Thanks.